Welcome back everybody. This is Eric here from Moss Pond and Gun. And uh, we're hanging out today in the reloading man cave here. Okay, and I figured what better place to talk about our 2014 man can than in the man cave. Uh, you know, you guys have seen the progress of the man cave here and it's been coming along pretty well. You guys might have remembered last year, we did a uh, video in December for Christmas uh, called Christmas uh, Gift Ideas for Shooters. Um, if you haven't seen that video, it might be something cool to check out. But we introduced a, a little concept, kind of a theory called the man can. And we got to thinking about it this year. And, you know, it, it's one of those things. It's one thing to give ideas and show things off and all this sort of thing. But we'd like to come up with an actual product that we put together. And we may even um, end up doing this, like, maybe on a regular basis. But we're going to try out 100 units uh, for Christmas just for our subscribers to check out if it's something you want to look at. But I do want to tell you about this whole man cans idea. So initially, you know, we were taking like ammo cans and stuffing them full of cool swag and just all types of stuff for, you know, the shooter in your family. And then you put it under the Christmas tree or give it to somebody as a gift. And it's just one of those cool things, you, like a mystery, you know, mystery box of random shooting and, and firearm industry outdoor related items that you may not get, you know, without, you know, you're not really going to know what's in there. So you guys might be familiar with uh, services like Loot Crate. Um, I hate to throw that out there in such a direct term, but Loot Crate is a subscription service where basically they'll announce like a theme for the month and then you'll get like some swag in the mail that's related to that theme, but you don't know what the swag is going to be, which is kind of cool. It's like a mystery and it usually has a certain price and everything like that and you run it and you get the swag box in the mail. So what we're going to do is we put together 100 uh, man cans. All right, now I'm not going to be able to sell the man cans in physical metal ammo cans, all right? That would make the shipping cost a little bit higher and it would also make the cost of the can considerably higher because military ammo cans have gone up in price considerably. So we'll probably ship these contents, you know, in some sort of like a flat rate box or some type of small cardboard box. So um, what we were thinking is we're gonna do $30 plus shipping. Now we're only doing 100 of them. So unless you guys just overwhelm my email box, with requests for more of them, we're only gonna do 100 for the first initial month of December. But what we're hoping to do is that if we can get three or 4,000 or, th or four or 5,000 of you guys on board on a regular basis, then what that'll do is allow my collective bargaining efforts to work for you. So if you guys come to me and you say, hey, we'll give you 30 bucks for a uh, man can that's themed around, let's say the AR-15 or the AK-47 or gun cleaning, gun maintenance, each month will have its little theme. You'll get a newsletter, you'll get your, uh, your man cam with all the cool swag. Um, now for December, I was actually able to work out some pretty cool stuff for you guys that I think is well worth 30 bucks. Uh, we got this cool Vortex hat, which is awesome. Uh, we've got a 1776 United uh, shirt, uh, really awesome pattern. Um, this particular shirt is the one that they call when men were free. It's an excellent shirt. You've probably seen it in tons of our videos. In fact, this actual shirt laying here is one of mine. It's not a brand new one. So it's probably a few little like rips and stains, but that's okay. Um, we've got a really cool key fob from uh, Savoie Leather. Um, these, I'm not sure exactly what the design will be. I guess it will have to be one of those surprise things. So if you can put two and two together, you probably know what's gonna be on it, but pretty cool leather key fob there. Um, also, you guys probably know All-Star Tactical, the uh, inked up gunfighter. He makes a product called Snake Oil. We got 100 jars of uh, snake oil. So we'll have those going out in the man cans for December, which is really cool. And you also get his wood, which is, you know, literally says inked up gunfighter and it's made out of wood. So when he walks up to you, he always gives you one and says, here, I'm giving you my wood. So anyway, that's kind of cool for some of you guys. Um, American Steelworks makes these little, uh, you know, beer openers. And they usually have like a little gun design uh, machined out of them, which is really cool. I'm not going to say which gun design it's going to be, but I promise you'll like it. Uh, this particular one's a shotgun, which is kind of cool. That just goes on your keychain. You can pop you open a beer or whatever. Really neat. Um, Geisley stepped up. They're going to send out some awesome swag. I don't know exactly what Geisley's going to be putting in the boxes. It could be anything from stickers, patches, maybe even extra hat. So right there at 30 bucks, you're getting a t-shirt and a hat, which is awesome. There may even be additional clothing items that I don't even know about yet because there's still a lot of people coming out of the woodwork and, and adding value to this package. So that's what this whole stuff uh, you know, revolves around is a lot of the companies I work with and a lot of the people that are willing to, to give me unit breaks on things, passing those savings along to you guys and you're getting something really cool for like 30 bucks. So that's kind of what we're looking to do. 
Key Bar is going to be sending out some cool swag, anything from koozies, stickers. Again, you don't know what you're going to get until you buy it and it comes to your doorstep, but uh, it'll be a minimum of the amount of items that are on this table, if not more. There will probably be more stuff than what I have here. This is just some initial pairings I was able to get together to showcase for you guys just to make this video. But Moss Pond's going to throw in a koozie, which is cool. You know, keep your beer cold in style. Skinny Medic is going to give a like small medic kit, like just kind of a small basic emergency medical kit, real basic first aid. Um, those will be coming through, which is kind of neat. You know, anybody's out on the range, out on the trail, you're always going to get little cuts and scrapes. Kind of nice to have something like that laying around. Um, I don't have a physical bar of fight soap to show you guys, but the guy that makes fight soap, really cool dude. So everybody's going to get a bar of fight soap in their man can. And bear in mind, we're only getting to do 100. So if you want one, go ahead and get it or whatever. I haven't really been able to clarify if everybody's going to get a Geisley sticker yet, but I might be able to turn their arm for that. We'll see. I'm going to try there. Um, Artisan Tony, the YouTube channel. You guys probably know Artisan Tony. He's uh, ponying up on some patches for everybody. Awesome there. So you get a patch. I'm putting two LPS one wipes in every single uh, man can. So you guys are going to get the box. It's going to contain some LPS one wipes. So from the standpoint of cleaning and everything, everybody always needs weapons wipes. So you get two LPS one wipes. Um, we're going to run Team Vortex sticker. Um, Vortex has been really cool to us this year. Great bunch of guys. So they ponied up on some neat stickers. These are great on like camera cases, Pelican cases, your gear, bumper, whatever. Just a great way to show support uh, for a great company. Great bunch of people. So guys, that's pretty much man cans in a nutshell. We've got a lot of things on the way video content wise, a lot of ideas that, you know, that we're putting forth. And ultimately something like this, if it takes off, it will help the channel grow and it will help the quality of the productions and the type of productions we can take on grow as a channel. So we are looking to take, you know, it's not really a profit thing. It's just more of like putting money back into what we're already doing as a YouTube channel and making our efforts with the YouTube channel more and more meaningful for you guys moving forward. So uh, we appreciate it. Um, we're going to see how this does. This is kind of a gauge. You know, I thought about doing a thousand man cans, but I decided on a hundred because I wasn't really sure how you guys were going to react to this. So we'll see if they sell out really quick, then we may consider doing another run depending on how it goes. Uh, but we're probably, you know, unless you guys just scoff at this idea and go, Hey, this sucks. Uh, we're probably going to do this once a month and with time. As the numbers grow, as we get more of you and more of you in the hat, if we can get you know several thousand subscribers on board that want to do this, then hopefully the contents of the swag can are going to get cooler and cooler. So guys, check out the website if you're interested in ordering. There should be full details there. If you have any questions, just uh, send us an email or give us a call at the shop. We'll do what we can to help. But uh, guys, we really do appreciate all the support that we get with the channel. And we look forward uh, to making more videos. And you guys stay tuned. we got much more in the pipeline. See you later.